Hey guys, Many Flames Away here, and I'm here to talk about the Koba thing and what that means for the future of Many Flames Away. So, if you don't know what Koba is, it's a thing, it's a law in place, particularly in the United States, that prevents websites from collecting data on children under 13. Pretty much, YouTube fucked up. And they collected data on children under 13. They got fined a lot of money. And because of that, they decided to implement a system that makes you mark whether your content is for kids or if it's not for kids. Now, what does that mean? Well, if you mark your content for kids, you end up losing 60% to 90% of your revenue from videos. Your comments are disabled. Your content won't be recommended anymore. You won't be able to search for your video anywhere on YouTube. Which makes me wonder how they even find your content by that point. How does that work? And notifications don't go out to subscribers if it is marked for kids. So... Pretty much nobody knows about your video unless they come across your channel. And you hear the fucking motorcycle outside? You gotta love that shit, right? Copa has said that there is a general audience exception. Which means there could be a differentiation between children, general audience, and not for children. General audience is what this channel is. But YouTube has decided not to implement that. They decided to make it black and white, children or no children at all. Although my content is for everybody. I play video games. That's appealing to children and adults alike. I have fun doing that. Everybody has fun watching me play them. Except for to some people. Fuck you. <laughs> Just today, I found out from this dude who was covering the COPA topic that an anonymous source came up to him and said that YouTube will not include a general audience option and added age gate for so users starting it up can access the website and access the videos. They won't do any of that because they're going to lose money. So Essentially, they're throwing us under the bus, the creators. Us, the creators, under the bridge. We're done. I'm done. I'm done with YouTube as a platform. I won't do this anymore. I'm, I'm done. I started using YouTube to make videos in 2010. I've been fucking around with this platform for nine years on different channels. Never would I have imagined nine years ago that YouTube would be in the state that it is today where you don't even know if you can make content for the service anymore. So here's what's going to happen. In one week, I am done with YouTube. I am going to move from YouTube to Twitch. We are not doing YouTube, we're not streaming on YouTube, no more video content will be made for YouTube. They are not getting any more of my money. So I'm going to be closing my AdSense account like tonight. And I won't be receiving any more revenue on any of my videos. I'm done with YouTube as a platform. I don't want to deal with them anymore. I can't stand them. Honestly, this past year has made me like them even less than when I started. So, I'm done with you, YouTube. I'm going to Twitch. You know, YouTube was an amazing journey. From the start of Many Flames Away, that is. I never thought I would see the day where I would hit 100k subscribers. Even though 98% of them don't even fucking give a shit anymore and they're just not here. Thanks 98% for not being here, I guess? I mean, you subbed, but you never actually contributed anything except subbing. For content you wouldn't even- why are you still subbed? Anyways.
This is going to be a treasure to me. Display button right here. Never thought I would see this. With many flames away on it, that is. It's crazy to think about. And I'm happy that I was able to make this milestone. But this milestone will never mean anything like it used to ever since this platform has fucked all of us over. Here's the thing. My channel blew up from a joke. A joke that YouTube's algorithm held so much value in that they decided to recommend this stream to 3 million people. But never recommend my other content as much. So I got known as the Yoshi guy, right? But that, that was never who I wanted to be. I wanted to be the cool person that everybody could watch and play games with and have a good fucking time, you know? Everybody wants to have a good fucking time. And that's all I was about. I just wanted people who liked the same shit I did. This play button was a product of YouTube's algorithm just throwing the, the one thing that I didn't actually put effort into out into the fucking wild, you know? And while I'm glad that 100,000 individuals subscribed, 98% of those individuals aren't here watching this video right now. I can guarantee it. They're non-existent. My channel has been buried under all of their subscriptions. I can bet it. And I bet you 5% of those 98% don't even get notified about when I upload or when I go live, although they're subscribed to me. Thanks to that nice little bell. Thanks, YouTube. Again, for making it more complicated for people to stay sub to, stay sub to the people who actually fucking care. <laughs> right? So... This play button is pretty much going to be the only play button I ever get on this platform. So I'm going to hang on to it real tight. I'm going to remember it. I'm not going to forget it. It's very, uh, it's very valuable in that sense. People keep, <laughs> you know how many times I've been offered to sell my channel? It's fucking hilarious. I've had like 25 plus people offer me to sell my channel while I was dying. And I'm gonna sell it to you to do what? Fuck up the Many Flames Away name? No thanks. I'm gonna be Many Flames Away, but I'm not gonna be Many Flames on YouTube anymore. So, before I go, one more thing. So, I said that I was moving over to Twitch in one week. That, that stands. We're gonna do that. But there's one more live stream I want to do on YouTube before I drop off the platform completely. So, on Saturday, this Saturday, I'm gonna be streaming for six hours and it's going to be Many Flames Away, the finale. We're gonna go over some of my old content, some of my <laughs> first videos, you know. Cringy shit like that, and uh, play some games together, you know, talk about all the good times we've had on the channel. Pretty much gonna be the last day. That Saturday is gonna be the last day of Many Flames Away. And then we'll move over to Twitch and uh, go from there. Alright? So, to all of you who's not going to be to that live stream because I'm not saving the replay of that live stream. It's going to be down. Um, this is the last video. This is it. I am glad that I've had the opportunity to do this. It was really fun. It had its rough times, right? That's every channel. That's every single thing that you're going to do in life. There's going to be those rough moments. But if you push through those moments, you get to the parts that are worth it. 
which is having a community of people, even if it's 2% of the not, like, the fucking 100,000 plus people. That 2% is all that matters. Those are the people keeping this channel alive, and has been doing that. I remember when I made this channel, the tagline was, get fired up, you know? Get excited for the possibility of crazy shit happening. Well, I can happily say that the crazy shit has happened. And now we get to go over to Twitch and make the crazy shit happen over there too. I'm going to become a partner, get up there, climb the ranks, get featured maybe. I think we can do it. Just keep it consistent and that shouldn't be a problem at all. So... I think this is a good time to, you know, say it one more time. Thank you. To all of the people who actually fucking cared and stuck around. To the people who actually stayed, not just for the stream, but for the content and the live streams I did. We had a good fucking time. And this Saturday, it's going to be the last good fucking time we have here on YouTube. So let's have a fucking blast. How about it?